Welcome. Please insert keycard. Processing. Access to Site 81's database has been granted. Secure. Contain. Protect. Item hash. SCP-4489 Objects Class, Safe Site Responsible, Site 81 Director, J. Carlyle Actus Research Head, K. P. Crow Assigned Task Force, N. A Level 2 4489 Classified SCP-4489 Special Containment Procedures. SCP-4489 is contained within a low security item locker at Site 81. Access to SCP-4489 is to be granted only with permission from the Site 81 Research Authority. Description SCP-4489 is a small, carved wooden statue of a cartoon hobo. Individuals exposed to SCP-4489 in close proximity will gradually begin to express feelings of guilt, often as a result of minor or non-existent slights they feel that they have somehow inflicted on those around them. Prolonged exposure to SCP-4489 often leads to such inflated feelings of guilt and regret that the subject becomes inconsolable or otherwise impossible to interact with until SCP-4489 is removed. Subjects typically return to a baseline behavior after SCP-4489 has been removed, time depending on the length of time exposed. Addendum 4489.1 Testing Log For testing purposes, SCP-4489 was set on a table in the center of a standard testing chamber. Subjects were then exposed to SCP-4489 in various scenarios and for various lengths of time. Control Test Log 4489.1.0 Site 81 Description SCP-4489 is set on a table in the middle of a testing chamber. D-91411 introduced to the testing chamber for a period of 5 minutes. Outcome, D-91411 is removed from the chamber after 5 minutes. Subject apologizes for being such a boring test subject. Test Log 4489.1.1 Site 81 Description SCP-4489 is set on a table in the middle of a testing chamber. D-95641 introduced to the testing chamber for a period of 20 minutes. Outcome, D-95641 is removed from the chamber after 20 minutes. D-95641 weeps openly upon extraction, stating that she didn't mean to breathe so much in there but it just couldn't be helped. Test Log 4489.1.2 Site 81 Description SCP-4489 is set on a table in the middle of a testing chamber. D-98446 introduced to the testing chamber for a period of one hour. Outcome, D-98446 must be physically removed from the chamber and is inconsolable for several hours afterwards. Once D-98446 is sufficiently calmed, he apologizes profusely for having to pee so bad. Test Log 4489.1.3 Site 81 Description SCP-4489 is set on a table in the middle of a testing chamber. D-84544 and D-91101 introduced to the testing chamber for a period of 5 minutes. Test Audio Recording Transcript D91101 and D84544 Enter Containment Chamber. After a few moments, SCP-4489 is brought into the chamber and set on a table. D91101, so what now? We just sit here? Dr. Branwa, yep. You just sit there. D84544, got it. 8 seconds pass. D-84544, hey, buddy. D-91101, yeah guy? D-84544, look, I just wanted to apologize for getting all up in your space right now. I shouldn't be doing that. Note, D-84544 and D-91101 are currently more than 3 meters apart. 
D91101, oh, God, you don't need to apologize to me, man. I'm sorry for making you feel like you were in my space. You're not in my space, if anything, I'm in your space. D84544, no, oh man, I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to imply that you didn't know what your space was, or whether I was in it, honestly. I hope you can forgive me, please. D91101 Tears begin to form in the subject's eyes. Oh no, I can't believe I've done this to you. I can't believe I put you in a position where you felt like you needed to apologize to me for an implication that I misread. I'm so sorry, pal. I didn't mean to hurt you this way. I'll get out of your space now. D91101 moves to the corner of the containment cell. D84544 bursts into tears and collapses to the ground. D84544, through tears, no I I'm so I'm so sorry you you felt like like you had to walk all that way just just to satisfy my 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 unreasonable space needs I'm sorry, sniff, please for forgive me. Weeps openly, D91101, no. I'm sorry for what I've done to you. It was my actions that reduced you to this. I am to blame. I'm sorry. D84544, crawling to the opposite corner of the room, WH what? I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you over over the sound of of my own distracting sobbing. D91101, shouting and weeping, oh god please no WH why do I do this to people? I'm so sorry for inconveniencing you like this by not properly articulating. I'm so sorry. D84544, I'm I'm sorry my my ears are so so, sobs, so dysfunctional. D91101, I'm sorry my inadequacies have put this ear doubt upon you, your ears are fine and I am at fault for being such an obnoxious, inarticulate buffoon. D84544, it 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 was my hideous visage that that did this to you, please, turns to face into the corner, please let me sp spare you my horrible face. I'm so sorry I am so hideous. D91101, please, please let me apologize for shouldering you with this insurmountable and misplaced self-doubt. I am the one with the hideous face. Turns to face corner. Please forgive me, my soul cannot handle this great regret I feel for harming you in this way. D84544, my entire life exists only to 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 be a mockery of a just existence. Inconsolable sobbing, after an additional 2 minutes of D84544 and D91101 screaming apologies into the corners of the testing chamber. Both subjects are removed and SCP-4489 is returned to storage.